Good Friday. We do the last thing to Christ. Amen. Observation reading. The Gospel of St. John, chapter 13. Just as our Savior who served all of humanity by offering himself up. His body was broken. His precious blood was shed. He gave us another example that we ought to show forth to one another. It was an act of humility that caused Jesus to go to the cross. He humbled himself and was obedient even the death of the cross. Here, during the feast of the Passover, the 13th chapter of the Gospel of John, starting at verse 1. Now, before the feast of the Passover, when Jesus knew that his hour was come, that he should depart out of this world into the Father, having loved his own, which were in the world, he loved them until the end. And supper being ended, the devil having now put into the heart of Judas Iscariot, Simon's son, to betray him, Jesus knowing that the Father had given all things into his hands, and that he was come from God and went to God, he rises from supper and lay aside his garments. Hold on. Isn't that something? The scripture keeps reminding us even, even the hour when Jesus knew he was being betrayed. It didn't matter. He was obedient. He didn't allow anything to deter him. Isn't it how easy we give up is if folks do something to us? We give up. We won't live for God. Glory to God. There is a 
Dost thou wash my feet? Jesus answered and said unto him, What I do thou knowest not now, but thou shalt know hereafter. Peter said unto him, Thou shalt never wash my feet. Jesus answered, If I wash thee not, thou hast no part in it. How many of y'all recognize Peter was getting in his flesh? <laughs> And he didn't want the Lord to wash his feet because he didn't want to have to get down to wash nobody else's feet. Is the servant any greater than his Lord? Don't you know we are to condescend and humble ourselves to serve a servant of lost humanity? So we all have kind of the privilege to be able to get down and to be like our Savior. Humble himself to serve a lost humanity. Simon Peter said unto him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head. Jesus said unto him, He that is washed needs not say to wash his feet, but is clean everywhere. And ye are clean, but not all. All right, that's enough. There is a place in the Lord I want to find. There is a place in the Lord I want to be. I want to go higher. I want to go deeper. There is a place in the Lord I want to be. That place of humility is where you want to be. That place of certitude is where you want to be. Glory to God. Bless that wonderful name. Bless that.